What's going on guys, how's it going? So, I recently transferred over from Samsung to iPhone. I know some people here will be thinking this, being like, right, he's an idiot. Ironically, it was quite a good change. I have to admit, I did enjoy the change because Samsung's were amazing phones. I have to admit, they were incredible. But I wanted to try iPhones out again because last time I had an iPhone, I think it was the iPhone 8 or I think it was 8 or 8 Plus or something like that. And I did enjoy them, but after that, they got boring. So then I transferred back over. Now I've got an iPhone 13 Pro Max terabyte or whatever the hell it's called. I don't really know. Uh, and charging it can be a bit of a pain, especially when I'm gaming or doing that. You know, having it on cables and stands drives me insane. And I can't really find justification of buying some that are online that cost an absolute bomb just to charge your phone. Didn't understand it. Well, not until a company called Ace Fast got in touch with me and asked me to review one of theirs. And... Obviously, I said yes. So today we're looking at the Ace Fast Super Fast Charger, and let's just get into it. So, guys, here we have it. This is the Ace Fast, and this is the Fast Charger Time Saving Dock, if you want to call it. So this one I've been looking forward to because I've been looking for a device like this to charge my new iPhone. And let's have a little look on the back first of all. So we've got 12 months hassle-free warranty, wireless fast charging for free, your hands, and also uh, comprehensive and diverse product changing. So I'm taking it. That means that there's more than one way to charge a device, I'm hoping. So let's get this unboxing. see what we've got. So first off, we do get a very small little user manual here. This is pretty much just going to tell you everything about the ins and outs of where things can live, where things can go. Uh, so nothing really exciting going on there. It tells you a little bit about the LED patterns on the front, which shows you roughly what's charging. So that's not too bad. So we do get a cable here, which is USB to USB type C, I believe. Oh, that's not too bad. Different cable, but not too bad. I like the sound of that. And then we have the dock. So if I move this up a little bit, you can see. So this is the dock we are talking about and relatively already looks extremely nice. So where to start? So we'll start from the bottom and work our way up to the main one. So on the bottom here, we do have a little headphone sign as you can see right there. So this is pretty much indicating if you have a pair of headphones like the Apple AirPods, I think there's a few other headphone companies out there. If you place this on the side here, it's gonna charge. I don't actually have any headphones at the moment that I can grab my hands on that actually charge but this is pretty much what it's for. You set your uh, headphones on there and it will wirelessly charge your headphones so you don't have to worry about getting cables and lugging them about. Now on the back here, this is another one that I really do like. This is for a smartwatch. Now I don't have an Apple watch, but I'm not sure if it will, I'm not sure if it's magnetic or, oh no, there we go, Never mind. So there we go, there's a magnet on the back of the Samsung watch as well, which actually does clip in, so not too bad so that's pretty much where your watch would sit as well if you wanted to wirelessly charge that as well most devices will accept it some won't so um it depends on the device i think this is related more to apple devices because you can wirelessly charge their headphones their watches as well as their phones now the this one i'm a little bit sure about so this one i think is only available to use on the newer style of iphones because of the magnet design now there's no way of like you know stopping your phone from sliding so i believe this is mostly meant for like apple devices because the new iphone i think it's the 12 and 13 series do have i think it's called mag loop or mag charge so here's a case for instance on the back of the case there is a magnetic strip here and here so basically when there's something connected to it it sticks to the phone itself like i said there's a magnet there that's going to stick this magnet then connects to a magnet on the back of the iPhone, which then charges it if I do it without the case. There we go. As we can see there, it's now connected. Uh, it's in response with a magnet at the back. And obviously if I, I can turn it and do it that way as well. So if I wanted to sit and watch something on my phone while it's charging, I have the availability to do that. Now it does, and it is also extremely strong when it comes to the case. So if I pop a case on here as well, and then slide that on, there we go. So we now have a case on there as well. It is actually, wow, that, whoa, that is really strong. Okay, so that is strong. That's definitely a good sign. So I definitely have to say this really does tick all the boxes for myself because I've been looking for one of these for quite some time. Uh, but I didn't really want to spend the amount of money that some places were, um, were charging for, you know, to charge my device. 
Now on the front here, we do have a little LED strip here. This has got three individual LEDs. Uh, when the phone is, when the device is connected, they do light up blue. When you connect the device, that will light up green, which will tell you and indicate to you that it is charging. So that alone is also quite good. So it's a little bit of an indicator. Now on the bottom of the device, on this portion and on the back of where your, oh, if I can grab that, where your watch is, there is grills. This is more to help with dissipating heat as well as anything else, because obviously while you're charging a device, it's gonna generate some form of heat. So that's also there to allow it to dissipate the heat as well as the, for some weight, just so when you put your phone on there, it doesn't just topple down the side and it doesn't fall over. So I definitely have to say it's a, it's a massive thumbs up for me. This also is gonna be living on my desk from now on because I like it when I'm just doing a little bit of product, uh, you know, testing and all that sort of stuff. I can just stick my phone on there, move it out of the way. I can see it from an angle. I don't have to continuously pick it up. It can be hands-free and I can just pretty much leave it there. If I wanna go sideways, I just twist it and I'm pretty much good to go. So I have to admit, incredibly, it is really, really incredible, I have to admit. So that's pretty much that for the, uh, the, the, that's pretty much it for this. I have to admit, small product, but relatively does a huge job. It is fast charging. It's going to save you a ton of time and the design alone really is nice. I like the fact that a majority of it, it is black, but on the bottom here, as well as the shaft portion here, they went for like a gunmetal gray. So that alone does add to the design and the aesthetics. And it's pretty much going to fit in extremely most minimalistic ways. It does come with a cable, which is obviously unfortunate. They can't wirelessly, wirelessly, wirelessly charge your device. So you do have a single cable that goes into the back of the device. So if you want this butted up against something with a small amount of cable coming out. So they have thought of everything when it comes to that. You can charge your phone, your smartwatch, as well as your headphones all at the same time. So I really can't see any reason why this shouldn't be on everyone's desk that owns them specific products. You've got four little rubber feet on the side as well. So when you do put it down, it's not gonna slide all over the place. It's fit and secure to the surface and you don't have to worry about the security of your products. So I definitely have to say this is a massive thumbs up for me. There we go guys. And this is what we've just reviewed. This was the Ace Fast Charger. Um, and I have to admit, really is incredible. The magnet on these are in actually stupidly strong. So I've got a case on the back of on my phone here. So if I touched it on, obviously, it is extremely strong, kind of even goes sideways as well, which is even better. So I have to admit, really is incredible. Um, I don't own an Apple Watch. I do own Apple AirPods that do go on the bottom there that you can charge them as well. I don't own an Apple Watch as of yet. Not sure if I'm going to get one. Uh, but I have to admit, it is quite cool that they've just been able to compact that into there. As well as the three LED lights at the front, you know, that are blue, shows up green when you're actually charging the device, which really is incredible. But this allows me to just, you know, stick my phone on and then whenever I want it to just grab it off, stick it back on. Now, I, I did say before, I think this only works with certain phones that do have the, the mag loop. Uh, if you don't know what that is, it is a magnetic ring in the back, pretty much like it's a magnetic case. So it looks like kind of like the similar design to that. It's like a circle on the back of the phone is basically a giant magnet. You can wirelessly charge your phone. So I know it works for iPhones. I think it's a 13 and 12, so I'm not sure about any of the others. I don't know if it would work for any other products like Samsung phones or anything that do have the similar charging features. I don't think it will, but I definitely have to say I am really, really happy with this device. Fits a perfect needs, a three in one, really good. If you do want to go check one out, as always, links in the description. Got any issues? Comment down below. And as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any further videos.